Hi, my name is Cheryl Klein. I'm a mental toughness coach, published author, speaker, and mother to a couple of great kids who happen to be club level high school and college athletes. This is the first in a video series titled A Parent's Guide to Mental Toughness for Teens. So of course it's incredibly important for teens to have a strong work ethic. But unfortunately it's an old way of thinking that practicing longer and harder and studying longer and harder in school is enough for teens to perform at the best of their ability. Teens need to learn to be mentally tough. They need to learn to manage their thoughts and emotions, especially in high pressure situations. So there's a study and actually a story about Michael Jordan when he was 15. He had a long-term goal. He really wanted to be a contributor on his varsity basketball team. So when he was a sophomore in 15, he didn't make it. He was really upset about this for a while, but then he got to work, and of course the rest is history. This is an extreme case, but it speaks to my point that long-term goals and dreams do not succumb to temporary setbacks. So there are different types of goals that are appropriate for different periods of time. Outcome goals are what we're going to talk about today. If you understand what outcome goals are, you can help your teen set doable goals that they can accomplish and in turn hopefully help build their confidence in the process. So outcome goals are long-term goals that are typically six months to about four years. They could be dreamlike and just remotely possible, but it's important that parents remain encouraging. These goals are deeply meaningful and personal to teens. Here's a couple key things to remember about outcome goals. They're typically six months or longer. They may be realistic or not, and teens have little to no control. It's really important for parents to remind them about that and let them know that it's okay and that they need to be at peace with that. So parents can also help out by staying encouraging as much as possible. These goals are way into the future and there's no sense or no reason to worry about them in the day to day, especially in light of temporary setbacks or errors. Teens just need to keep practicing and understand that these goals will happen. So here's a parent tip. If you can take a few minutes to sit down with your teen, ask them in the long term what's really important to them, and then ask them why. If you can have them write these things down and put it somewhere while well, they have a look at it often, that will really be helpful to them. And also, it's really helpful if parents can remain non-judgmental and just listen to what they have to say. So if you found this short video helpful, I encourage you to pass it along and share on your social media. I appreciate you taking the time to watch and to help your team become mentally tough. Next week, we're going to talk about performance goals.